this right here is gonna be a girl miss marie and child your girl went to trader joe's today like literally like right after work it only took me like a couple minutes to get there so we love that we love trader joe's life and i want to say trader joe's or at least the one i went to child they've been slipping um i went to trader joe's last week i want to say was it friday friday child and one of the young ladies there told me that they would have been able to have by then had ordered the um daily facial sunscreen whatever if i can i'm going to insert a picture of it but if not i know i talked about it in my last vlog so today's date okay guys is going to be may 24th and what i was rambling about the young lady said that they were just going to make an order may 22nd so i said okay cool i'm coming two days after they're gonna have it boom 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 but apparently the guy who said it was his uh, section of stock child he said he wasn't here so he ordered it uh yesterday i said child i was like anybody else for that but anyways guys so um if you're new here this right here even though today's day is going to be may 24th this right here is actually going to be in the next month vlog so this right here is going to actually officially start out june's yes with an s vlog okay guys um i am going to continue to do these vlogs however just let me know if you guys are actually honestly feeling these or liking these because i don't know if you guys are aware of this but vlogs actually take the longest time to edit maybe you guys don't care but if you guys aren't feeling these look just let me know okay because i can just go ahead and do my little shopping haul videos and do my wig tutorials and all that jazz anyways as i stated the girl came straight from work this is my little work attire okay <laughs> given skinny per what my uh sibling said so anyways guys so i'm gonna try to but i actually didn't spend a lot i only spent like i wanted 70 bucks 70 snack rooms so anyways i'm your girl got my ever so favorite sliced french frio spread and i already have a little bit right here but i'll go through this rather fast so yeah guys so i picked this up this right here was ringing in at three dollars 99 cents and I wanted to try this, okay guys? So TikTok definitely influenced me. So these are here gonna be the Trader Joe's Sour Cream and Onion Flavored Rings. These are made with lentils and rice. So this right is basically just a healthy alternative. Now I do like onion rings. I remember growing up when everybody used to get like the little, uh, what's it called? The little variety pack. And they would have in there onion rings and like um, corn chips. I feel like those would be the last two that would be there. Or like the plain Doritos. Like you have to be a special kind of person like those. And my mom says I'm special all the time. So I just wanted to try these out. Um, the calories, if you guys can't, so it's going to be the back of the bag. All that stuff. But I do know this is gluten free so we love that here. Then, my good old watermelon cucumber cooler drink. And I know people say this right here is great to be uh, like used for mixing, but child, honestly, I drink this as is. Um, while sometimes you think that some of the items you get from Trader Joe's are actually healthy, child, uh, the sugar is going to be sugaring. So this right here has 23 grams of sugar plus an additional 21 grams of sugar. So while this does feel light and airy and only contain 15% juice, child, just know what you're getting into when you're drinking this. Come on, see. Yes, you're going to spend $69.74. I just want to make sure I'm quoting you guys the right price. Yes, so the watermelon cooler was $3.49. Okay, we are spread. I knew it would have popped my head. So I opted to try the unexpected broccoli cheddar soup. Um, I've never seen this before. So honestly, I'm hoping this gives off a little Panera Bread dupe. I don't know if it is going to. But yeah, guys, I picked this up. This right here was ringing in at, and I've never tried this before. four dollars and 99 cents the ounces on this it's gonna be 20 ounces so we love that i'm just gonna put this in the refrigerator it's like right here guys. then we have the infamous brazilian nut body butter okay guys and also got the body wash now here's the thing with this i tried this when it first came out like they were restocking this today at the trader joe's um that i tend to go to more than others again there's so many trader joe's around me like i just close my eyes so kind of like a rainbow moment i can find me one so this right here was ringing in at five dollars and 99 right yeah and the body wash also was drinking in at five dollars like that. So if you guys care, the ounces on this is gonna be 16 fluid ounces, and the ounces on this right here is gonna be eight ounces. Now, one thing I will say, well, one, the Trader Joe's had testers, so we love that. I like the smell of this. Um, I am gonna try some layering techniques with this because I remember when I tried this, it sort of kind of like peeled up on my body. So I'm hoping that that doesn't happen again. If it does, Trader Joe's accepts returns, so I'm hoping that you know now this back is better. Like that's all I'm back and I'm better. Okay, guys. So, and I like body wash. Um, I am a person who does buy body wash 
you know, one to actually clean and, you know, make the skin feel moisturized and it's something to smell good. So I figured that's what that's going to at least be good for. Now, you guys already know how I feel about this. This right here is going to be the chocolate cocoa almond. It's basically an almond joy chow, but a Trader Joe's dupe. Um, this right here was ringing in at $4.99. And I know what you're thinking. Yes, child, but these are worth it. Like, for basically five smackies for this. But I love it so much, so I had to re up on that. Just gonna put this. Then, I wanted to try the infamous spicy honey sauce. Um, I believe this right here was ringing in at $3.99 or $4.99. Let's see this. See? $4.99. Um, the internet said this is good on pizza and on other things. So I would say, child, let's go ahead and try this because I like spicy things and I like sweet things. Like, so I like meat. Like, I'm spicy. And then I'm sweet. Yeah. There's a new one for me. Then I also, again, was influenced from TikTok. This right here is going to be the crunchy chili onion hummus. Now, I know some people say this honestly isn't worth money. You can just go ahead and buy some plain hummus and then buy the Trader Joe's crunchy chili onion um, mix to top this off. I said, child, I said, everybody got time to do all that. So I got this. This right here was ringing up at $3.99. So we're going to see again, guys. I'm going to put this in the refrigerator. Okay. And then in this bag, then we have this bag which is filled with, you know, uh freezer items and why today child the first time you guys know when i'm in my vlogs like i like to talk to you guys this is like where you're really going to get the meat of it i had my bags up at the top and the girl is like um will you be uh would you like to purchase a bag today so like, child do you guys see this big freezer like bag that says together for a cure child i don't want to pay no five cents for no bag i have reusable bags always i traded joe's one here and then this one most of the time, two bags are good enough for me. Because again, I was like, yeah, they need myself and I. Like that Beyonce song. So your girl got the chicken fried rice. So I got one bag of this. Um, I believe this right here was $3.99. Yes, $3.99. Then I got the vegetable fried rice, $2.99. And honestly, I really need to make a decision and figure out which one of these I like more. I'm hoping it's the vegetable one, child, because I can save a dollar. Um, they should be the same size. Actually, they're not. The vegetable one is 16, and then the chicken is 20, but it's probably because of like, you know, chicken probably is just added to it, guys. But um, your girl has tried all of these. So by all of these, I'm not have, I know I have two in my hands. The right thing, girl, is three. Yes, the shrimp fried rice is amazing. However, I just feel like uh, the cost of it is just a little bit too much, but and it's like super spicy, but I love spicy foods. So that's not really an issue. It's honestly just the fact that they be throwing in there like three, four shrimps, and then they be like, oh, child, whatever the price is, I don't know. But definitely not $3.99, definitely not $2.99. So girls definitely gonna figure out which one these are like this, okay? Then I love this. This right here is gonna be the multi-grain blend with vegetables. Okay, guys, and this right here was ringing up at $2.99. No guys, this is good if you like the taste of like vinegar. Um, this has a strong taste of vinegar in it. Um, and again, this the cooked grain is gonna be barley, it's gonna be whole rice. Um Peas, carrots, zucchini, vinegar, extra virgin olive oil, onion, sugar, salt, and pepper. This right here has less than um, four grams of sugar, and it has less than one gram of added sugar. And honestly, I'm loving the caloric that I use on this, guys. And this right here is very much so giving me healthy. And again, if you like vinegar, this is for you. Like, this is amazing. And again, to none of that. And then we're gonna have the colorful carrot coins, guys. Okay, this right here was ringing up at two days out. Again, these things really good. And I'm a microwave type of lady type of chick, so this definitely gets microwaved. Then we have the organic rainbow cauliflower. This right here was ringing up at $2.99. Again, guys, I'm a microwave type of lady. Now, with this, I honestly would say that this is probably better as it states on the back. Conventional oven is an option or air fryer. Did you guys know cauliflower don't taste like that anyways? Like, I don't know if we out there trying to, uh, you know, convince. We don't have to convince our mind, body, and spirit. And soul. they already know. All of them. You know. So, just go ahead, you know, make it a little bit uh, crispy. And throw this in the air fryer or the oven. That's my preferred method with that. Then we have my favorite, favorite item from the Trader Joe's section. This right here is going to be the 
come out chicken guys this right here is ringing up at five dollars ninety nine cents. yes i know the price but i'm just going to double check child let me double check let me double check yes five dollars ninety nine cents and honestly guys um this is very much so giving spicy very much so giving like better than probably your local um carry out or you know chinese food store or asian food store because i have well, i have this theory that all of those stores are not probably you know owned by uh people of chinese descent guys so um but yeah this does come with peanuts however you do not have to use the peanut packet but this right here really is like if there is one thing i would, could say i would shoot well two things i can say that i would like forever like stand on one is going to be a food product one is going to be a um a skincare product it's going to be this kung pao chicken again only if you like spicy food just go ahead and add this with like a bag of like the vegetable fried rice or brown rice or you know the jasmine rice that Trey Joe's has which i haven't tried yet go ahead do that and then it's going to be the infamous trader joe's facial sunscreen okay that right here is coming in at an spf of 40 which is amazing and it's water resistant again guys i'm only saying these facts because your girl just goes swimming um you know on a uh, almost weekly basis so i use that all the time and i'm literally like almost done the last time i picked some up i did stock up i think i, be I believe i got three of them so you guys but and again, it's only bringing up at, I believe, $8.99. And after it's the best thing for your buck because most sunscreens cost way more than that. People are saying that there's going to be a dupe for the uh, Super Goop or Super Goop unscreen sunscreen. I can't attest to that because, child, they will never get my money because they're just like giving me $30 and up on a sunscreen product that I'm going to use on an everyday basis. So, child, I ain't got time for that. Just a reminder. Just a reminder. So guys, this right here is gonna be the menu. Literally, no one's in here. No one's in here with me, guys. Just me, myself, and I. Like that Beyonce song. Hey, everybody. It's gonna be your girl, Miss Lori here. And I'm at a local pizza shop where all their food is like non pork products. So we love that here. Yes, your girl is sweating. But we look cute. Giving a natural beat. What lace? Here, guys. Um, they have really good food, so I drove out here because it's that amazing. Look at the big hair guys, curls given. This guy, this right here is going to be the outfit. With the tough fleecy. Just a Friday night out, guys, by myself. I got myself my pizza, so we ready to go. Okay, okay. Okay, y'all. This right here is going to be my pizza for party of one. Yes, I took two slices, but guys, this right here is that girl. Is that girl. Because, again, everything is made with either turkey or chicken. So, we love that. Love is life. Look at my friends, everybody. Look at my friends. Now, to the 
Everybody, this right here is going to be the wharf in DC. I know that somebody's standing in front of the W, but just know that that's a W right there, like the hotel. Everybody, this right here is going to be your girl, Miss Marie. And as you guys can see in the background, there is my crazy friend Shawnee. So we just came from dinner at Hell's Kitchen guys. And um, the weather honestly is perfect. Hence why I'm wearing my little two piece denim set. And you guys are definitely gonna see this again out in real life. I have the Bottega Duke Emery's on. You guys know how your girl does it. Oh look, she's so helpful. Um, but yeah guys, so dinner honestly was good to me. I got the prefix menu. Um, and what are your thoughts, Shunnies? It was exquisite, exquisite. <laughs> so we definitely will recommend it guys. Um, but you know me, I'm frugal, so I like the best thing for my buck. And honestly, I was able to get some scallops with the beef wellington and also with the toffee sticky pudding with ice cream. And guys, apparently the ice cream there costs $4. So uh, take that with you as you will. Oh, and you guys know that sometimes, you know, I prefer not to have a little libation. So I did have sparkling water for nine smacky roomies oh and when i call places you guys know me like i am um somebody who likes to be informed so i called hell's kitchen and i asked them i said do y'all do uh uh do you guys have a corkish free fee because i actually was going to treat my friend shanice because she's so bougie y'all i actually was going to bring in a bottle of wine probably like some camas or something because i figured we all were eating beef and i think all like three out of four of us did eat beef but child, they said that they don't uh, allow people to bring outside wine. I said, uh. I said this right here was a fancy, classy establishment. But again, they are new, so maybe that's something that they will explore in the near future. But I was like, what? No corkage fee, because most of the time corkage fees be about between thirty and forty-five dollars, which isn't bad if you're bringing a hundred dollar plus a bottle of wine. But yeah, guys. So now we're walking back to the car, and you guys know anything about DC, especially downtown the wharf. Is this downtown? Well, no, Southwest Waterfront parking is very 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 hard and your girl is not going to pay 25 plus dollars to stay inside a garage so yeah guys so we're just walking now so um again i never told you guys today's date is going to be may 26th it is a friday and your girl is outside but only temporarily though guys you guys know me i'm old and i told shanice i said girl we gotta go said i'm getting sleep okay so already guys so i'll talk to you later bye Okay guys, so again, I have not been like over here in a very, very, very long time. And honestly, truly, I could be totally going the exact wrong way. So let's see, because I shouldn't really be going outside. This should be the one that takes you um, to the offices. So we're gonna see if I even, got on at the right thing I'm trying to go based off of memory guys Whew. but this feels like this is right so I'll check back in with you guys later okay everybody so my memory served me correct and we're headed there so let's see Everybody. Okay, everybody, so we're here for this, so let's see how this goes. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. 